Hello, I'm Kevin at Rumors Music. I'm gonna show you this today. This PV amp, really sought after the uh, So they were made in the late 80s, early 90s. And uh, I personally had one, it was my first uh, proper amplifier. It's the PV and it's a special 112. It's a solo series. Now this is Scorpion equipped. You'll see some uh, pictures in, in the bio if you click the link to the website. Now, PV were making uh, two speakers at the time, the Sheffield speaker, the Scorpion speaker. Now this one is the Scorpion equipped speaker. There's a nice badge there on the front. Uh, I, rem I remember when they came out and I mean, I mean, I was 12 at the time, so I didn't really know much, but everyone was saying, oh, they, they sound like valve amps. They, they, they're like exactly the same. You can't tell the difference. And just uh, absolutely beautiful. They're so rich, so warm. So you've got clean channel with a three band EQ and a presence. So you've got low, mid, high, and then a presence as well, which will really brighten it, make it nice and shimmery. You've got a overdrive channel, so it's called the, the uh, lead gain channel. And on there, you've got bottom, which is bass, but it really fills it up. I'll go on to the overdrive in a, in a, in a bit and I'll show you how it sounds. Uh, you've got the bottom, body, and then edge. So the edge is the, the cutting high mids, and then the bottom and the body really help shape that that thickness and warmth that, that replicates a, a valve amp basically. It's in near perfect condition. Uh, there's no dints or bangs or anything like that. It's not been gigged, uh, but there is a just a little bit of rust on the uh, on the screws on the top. That's it. Other than that, uh, I mean, just just looking at it, it, it brings back so many memories for me. I I, I had the bandit bandit. 75 i think but it was all part of this range all the manuals were exactly the same for the solo series the specials 112s the bandits they were all the same just just different shapes and sizes some had the sheffield speaker as well like i said this one's got the scorpion equipped now we've also got a, a spring reverb which is brilliant so i'll just turn the reverb on full <laughs> sounds so good so I, I have the reverb on about three so in fact I'm going to turn it down to two sounds so rich and so warm i've got the all the eqs are in the center uh so on the clean channel on the lead it's a little bit different so i'll just play you a little uh, a little riff on clean and then i'll play some on the uh, overdrive channel as well okay <laughs> and gig with it a, a good point i should mention it can go very very loud it will keep up with any drummer who hits really really hard uh, and literally the volume there is on one doesn't go up to 11 <laughs> it 
goes up to 10, the volume is on one, they are very, very loud. Uh, I mean, for, for the price, this amp is as well, wow. Yeah, like I said, perfect for gigging musicians, but it also sounds great at low volumes, like I've just demonstrated. Right, so, I will go onto the lead channel now. So, it's this button here. Channel switch. absolutely fantastic check it out the link to buy it will be in the bio to this video also riversmusic.co.uk loads of great gear on there and loads of views and x display bargain so check it out Well, oh, this guitar by the way is absolutely beautiful fender player stratocaster absolutely brilliant i'll just got that uh, channel switch off there we go You've got a uh, send and return on this amp as well for your effects. It's amazing. Like I said, it was only on one. It goes very, very loud, but I'm not going to demonstrate that because I might break the uh, microphone and the camera. Thanks for listening. I'll see you again very soon. Cheers. Bye-bye.